While y'all keeping this thing moving from New York City, I want to bring out my man, Rip Michaels. Give him a round of applause, y'all. Rip. Rip it up. What's up, how y'all doing? Brooklyn, make some noise. I see all these sexy ass ladies in here. I'm gonna let you know something right off the bat. I don't lie to women. If any of you ladies in here think I'm cute, I'm gonna let you know something right off the bat. Look, I ain't got no car. That's right, I caught the train over this bitch. That's right. Any of you ladies wanna get with me, listen up. I got an unlimited Metro card. That's right. I swipe that bitch away. 18 minutes, you come the fuck to. That's right, welcome to the struggle. I don't lie to women, because you can't. Women are too smart. Women are like detectives, you know what I'm saying? You've been alive to a girl to take too much. You've been alive to her to tell her you got some big ass fancy job. Then she catch your ass working at a path mart or a Kroger or something. She'd be like, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, hold up. Uh-uh, wait a minute, uh-uh. You told me you was a producer. You'd be like, I ain't say I was no producer. I said I work in produce, produce. Don't you see the apples, oranges, and the grapes? Tell me, where's this Lexus you said you had? Not this Lexus. I said I was dyslexic. Get shit back, what's hard for me to read? Pay attention, baby, pay attention. See a couple people here coupled up? I don't date no more. That shit is expensive, man. It is, right? Think about it, fellas. You take girls out nowadays, flowers, candy, movies, abortions, that shit at least 350. <laughs> Nigga, get that shit done right away. I ain't even gonna lie. Sometimes I go to abortion clinics just to meet women. But you gotta be careful because they said you gotta walk up to them like, look, 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 stop crying, stop crying, look, look, look. I know you feel bad about what you just did, but I have good news. I just saved a lot of money by switching to Geico. <laughs> Good news, good news, bitch. Good news is good news. That's right, be yourself. Certain shit I don't wear. See, my T-shirt stop right here. Some guys take it too far. You see little guys walking the hood, T-shirt come all the way down to their knees. That's some gay ass shit. Nigga, that's not a T-shirt, that's a jersey dress in this motherfucker. I'm sorry, that's some bitch shit, nigga. You don't intimidate me, nigga. If you got a gun, you gotta get another nigga to lift up your dress to get to that motherfucker. You see them, don't they be like five, six of them walking in a row like they a gang for Todd or some shit, don't you? You see them, as soon as you see them, the first thing you think of is like, mama keeps me looking like I'm brand new. Mama's got the magic of Clorox too. I keep shit real, I still like R. Kelly. How many of y'all still like R. Kelly? Round of applause. That's the shit, ain't it? That's the only nigga with a court case pending that you would dance to like ain't shit wrong. You'd be like, step, step, side to side. Fuck that, he did it for love in this motherfucker. <laughs> Girls had it coming. I'm a big R. Kelly fan. I just knew that nigga had a problem a long time ago. If y'all to listen to the music, you'd have realized R. Kelly had a problem with young girls. Remember that first song he met? That's when he met his first little young girl walking down the street. He was like, how old are you? 13, damn. My mind's telling me no. But my body, my body's telling me, yeah, I don't want to hurt nobody. After having a little girl, he felt so bad. That's when he came with that second song. He was like, well, shit, it seemed like you were ready. I could have sworn you were ready. He thought she was going to tell. That's when he came with that third song. He was like, shh, keep it on the down low, down low. He finally met a girl his own age. That's when he came with that last song. He was like, how old are you? 35. Damn. If I could turn, turn back the hands of time, you would be five. What? <laughs> Nigga, R. Kelly's beats be so hot, we don't give a fuck what he sing. We'll still dance to it, won't we? R. Kelly could just come out, move your body like you ate, ma. <laughs> if you don't tell, then it's not rape, ma. You know what I'm saying? You don't give a shit. R. Right, Kelly could film his videos in a toy store. You'd still watch that shit, wouldn't you? He could film his shit in a KB or some shit. You'd be like, she had me buying toys and toys and toys and toys and toys and toys. For who may need to know, 12 is good to go. Let her in the store. Now she's one in a Barbie Jeep. I like the way her shoes light up at her feet. She just grew in her front two teeth. To pee on her would be my fantasy. Now she's one in the Power Wheel car. Y'all tell me what's Toys R Us without the R. Nigga, there is no Toys R Us without R. Kelly and this bitch. I don't see why though. I don't like young girls. I like older women, right? Older women, 25 and up with kids. That's what I'm talking about. Because older women don't play games. Y'all don't. Young girls play games with the dick. They look at it, examine it like, what's this bump right here? What's this? I'll be like, bitch, I'm diabetic. Don't look at it. My sugar low. Don't look at the bump. 
Young girls go down, they, they y'all aggressive with it. Y'all pencil in the dick. Y'all know exactly what y'all want. And when y'all go down on the guy, y'all do something extra once y'all do it. Y'all do. Y'all suck a guy dick, y'all do something special afterwards. Y'all do. Y'all go down on a guy, y'all suck his dick. After y'all do it, y'all do something, something sweet. Something just you ain't never expected. Like an old woman suck your dick, make you macaroni and cheese with the four cheese in it. You know what I'm saying? Old women suck your dick, make you pumpkin pie after they do it. You know what I'm saying? Older women suck your dick and hum Frankie Lyman songs while they do it. Like, you be like, this bitch is goody goody. This bitch is goody goody. But you gotta go down on a return, right, ladies? How many of y'all like guys to go down, right? That's right. How many fellas go down, right? Fellas go down? Nah, no, just a couple, see? I'm telling y'all, niggas, y'all need to start, nigga. Y'all need to start, nigga. Pussy is good for you, nigga. I'm telling you. Nigga, pussy got vitamins in this shit, nigga, do. Pussy got iron, zinc, potassium, phosphorus, nigga. You know how much iron is in one lick of pussy? Do you realize that? You'd have to eat nine bowls of special K to equal one lick of pussy. That's 18 bowls of raisin bran in this motherfucker. Pussy is the nighttime sneezy, stuffy head fever so you can rest in this bitch. My name is Rip Michaels. Do enjoy the rest of y'all show.